How, how's the summer been, first off? Oh, uh, the summer's been good. I'm, you know, I'm out here competing, working, trying to get better. What has that competition at right tackle been like this off season? Um, I mean, it's been good um, for the most part. Um, you know, just trying to get better every day. We're all out here competing, trying to fit the right, uh, get the best guy in there. What has Josh Simmons brought to your guys' offensive tackle room? Uh, he's definitely very talented. I mean, he works hard. You can tell he's a guy that works on his craft a lot. So, uh, yeah, he's a, he's a good player. Does that push you when another guy comes in and he's competing for that same spot? Uh, I mean, yeah, but I mean, for the most part, I mean, we're on the same team. The best guy, uh, we're trying to get the best guy on the field, you know, the best player on the field. So, I, get, I mean, we help each other out. We give each other encouragement you know, some tips and stuff like that. I know like, you know, middle of spring, you were kind of still learning the position. Like by the end of spring, how comfortable did you feel at that right tackle spot? Uh, I felt pretty comfortable. I mean, it didn't take me long. I, I mean, uh, I had a lot of good coaching. I had a lot of times to make a lot of mistakes. So I felt very comfortable right now. What do you feel like are the biggest things you need to do in preseason camp to win that job? Um, just like show like cons consistency, like just to be able to do things consistently well. Because I mean, obviously, I mean, I know I can play football. What sort of things did you work on this summer? Uh, just trying to become a better uh, football player. I mean, just to know the game better. Um, I mean, sitting around with coaching, trying to get to uh, understand the game a little better. Yeah. How much has Josh been a leader for you guys as an offensive tackle unit? Josh Fryer? Yeah. Oh, he's, he's a real good leader. I mean, he motivates us every, like every day. I mean, he uh, leads by example and all that stuff. So, yeah, he's been a real good leader. Tegra, what's it like just being out here and coming out and being a part of a community of these events? I mean, this is great. This is the stuff I really love. I mean, just giving back to the community, getting to uh, see kids out here smiling, having fun. You know? it's, a, it's a joy I wish I had growing up. I mean, to come out here to be at the school. But, I mean, no, nah, it's a lot of fun being out here. What kind of just intensity have you seen from a team in summer workouts as you guys are prepared for this season? Uh, these workouts are life-changing, um, to say that. But, I mean, we need it. I mean, we're going to use it to our advantage to be able to get to a place where no one else can follow us. You think there's a different hunger with this team with the way the last two years have gone in that rivalry game? Uh, definitely. I mean, we want to win. That's it. Who's impressed you in summer workouts? Who's impressed you in summer workouts? Oh. I mean, honestly, everyone, I mean, we all had to find a whole new different gear going through these workouts. And, yeah, everybody. I know, uh, you know, you and Jair were here last year. You got Malik here last year. What's it like just having a few Lakota West guys all on the same team uh, now? It's, it's real good. I mean, it's, it's good when we all go back there and, you know, all the other kids come up and they see us. They just see, like, a place where they can they can get there one day, too, I mean. We wore those jerseys just a couple years back. What do you think those guys can bring to the secondary? Uh, they're they're playmakers. They make plays. So Jair, whenever the ball's in the air, you never know what's going to happen. But you know it's going to be a good play.